Hey guys, so I'm back with another wig video, and this one is a braided wig video. Now, I'm always tripping about how you say the name of these type of twists, but you know, Senegalos twist, I think that's how you say it correctly. Either way, I'm pretty sure you guys know what I'm talking about. So as you guys see, this is a custom made unit. They did put some elastic on this. They also put it on a closure. It has an adjustable strap. It has all that good, good, good stuff that makes a wig. So the name of this hair company is Hair to Please, and it's located in the UK. They do have a lot of different styles that I'm pretty sure you guys will love, so make sure you check them out. Prior to this video, I did cut the wig cap in my um, stocking cap on the top just so that my wig cap doesn't slip around. And I'm applying some of the Sally Hansen's leg spray. I've had this stuff for years. So guys, let me know what you think of this unit. Like, um, I do really, really like it. I like the braids. But I did notice that on the side right here, it was kind of like snipped open. It was broken or ripped or whatever cut. So when I catch some time, I'm definitely going to go ahead and sew it. But in the meantime, I'm going to take a little bit of my hair out in the front. I'm not really sure why I'm doing this because I really don't end up using this hair in the front anyway. But I'm experimenting. So just, you know deal with it or not even deal with it but just you know just come along with me for this braid wig ride okay um but I did braid it up in the front like this or twist it because in case I wanted to pull it back but it kind of didn't look too right pull back so that's why I didn't use twisties but anyway the hair is really soft it doesn't itch um I've, I've got one that itched before that someone had made not only did it itch but it was so stiff and it just smelled really bad so I was really happy about this one that it didn't smell for one and it wasn't it wasn't itchy um, and I can wear this like honestly I can definitely wear this one so if you are interested in their wigs they don't just do closures they do 360s and they also do ear to ear frontals I'm thinking that the 360 is probably the best out of the best but if you don't want that I would definitely you know say go for like an ear to ear with an ear to ear you can definitely pull it back you can do like all different styles with that you know Hair be looking like it's on fleek for the summer. I'm saying, honey, it's like for real. Now listen, honey. Me, I love braids. I used to have braids all the time, but I don't have the patience to sit and just deal with someone braiding my hair for hours, or vice versa, me braiding my hair for hours. You know, once you start doing the braids, you definitely have to finish it. So it's not like you can just put it down like you do a wig, a regular wig, and just come back to it like let's say in a week. You can't do that. But I give them kudos and many props for these wigs because these Senegalas twists are so tiny. They're so tiny, but I love the way that they flow. They just make wearing this wig so like, you know, different, unique, and like, this is like some summer hair. This is something that if you say, you know what, I wanna get some braids tomorrow, girl, all you gotta do is go on their website and buy a wig. Like, it's just that simple. They got uh, box spray wigs, they got cornrow wigs. They don't have the um, faux dread wigs, but I'm pretty sure soon to come, that will be next on their list. They got them in all different colors. You can get them customized. Like, listen, the options are endless. Just like how I'm braiding this hair right here. This was just this, a little starter, a tease to show you what you can do. But I'm pretty sure you guys, you can find many different styles to wear with this hair to please a UK cine glass twist wig. So let me know what you think of this unit because I think I'm rather cute. And I do believe it is 20 inches. Okay, hunty? Hmm. Okay, you guys. Okay, so look at this wig. Like, this is really like amazing. I love to see like these braided wigs. Um, especially when they're like custom made. You know, this is like really, really a nice one. Now, mind you, I did get one many, many months ago, and let me tell you guys, I didn't even bother to wear it because it was so itchy and it was very, very smelly and like. Trust me, this is by far nowhere near like this. The hair is very soft, so for one, I'm glad that I'm not scratching and itching um, because it is just sitting on my head and I feel really, really relaxed and loose and like I'm able to just, you know, stay cool for the summer. But the cool thing about these braided wigs is that they look so natural and so realistic. Plus, also, you don't have to do a lot. Like, we all love to put wigs on, but sometimes, a majority of the time, we have to style them. And, like, that leaves us to 
sitting, styling, and also when it's just hair all over, it does tend to make us a little bit more hotter. So I think like these braided wigs, Senegalese twist wigs are amazing for the summertime, especially when you don't really want to do much. And they do go with a lot of different styles. So this one is Lara, and she's between 22, I think 26 or 24 inches you can get her. This is just the closure portion, so it's really small, but you can also get ear-to-ear -ear lace front or a 360. Now, definitely with the ear-to-ear -ear or the 360, you can definitely put it up in a bun. But if you have, you know, tips and tricks and you can do like a MacGyver, you can definitely do that to the front of this. You just definitely will have to probably like pull a little bit of your hair out and kind of like twist it in. But I do love this because it's very full. Now, these are micro, micro Senegalese twists, okay? And if I'm saying it wrong, then please forgive. But these are very, very thin micro ones, okay? Now, there are a lot of people that sit and get their own hair braided like this. And you know what? I'm going to say y'all to this. I'm going to say this to y'all. Bless your souls because I could not sit that long, especially when it comes time to take them out. I don't know how you guys do it, removing them when they're especially micro braids, either micro braids or micro Senegalese twists. Twist. Oh, you guys are like patient. For those of you who are like myself and don't have patience, then by all means, these wigs are definitely amazing. So the shipping time is really, really short because I got this within like five to seven days and it did come from the UK, but it came pretty quick. Okay. You can definitely get a custom unit. I think they take about three weeks. I'm not really, you know, I can't remember a whole lot, but I definitely will link all the information below for you guys. So that way, you know, if it's something that you order and you didn't like it, make sure that you return it with the lace still on it. So don't start cutting and then put it on and decide, well, this isn't for me or I don't like how it turned out. Definitely try it on prior to cutting any lace. And you know, that goes with any type of lace wigs. That's how it works. But the prices are really, really affordable. Um, for me, you know what? I think like this is a great alternative to sitting in the chair for hours upon hours and getting braids, especially it allows your hair to breathe and you can do many different styles with it. I think this one is nice. Like it's super full. It is synthetic hair, but I love the way she did the ends. It looks like she boiled them. Either way, she did like a fantastic job on it. The length is really nice, but the density of it is amazing. And even though it's only just like a closure portion, you can definitely switch it from middle to side part or like I said you can always get like an ear to ear or a 360 now I would love to try like an ear to ear or I would definitely love to try like a faux locks one I love the faux locks the whole idea of faux locks is just beautiful they're really really pretty and I have seen some that are nice and I've also seen some braided wigs like this one that are amazing and so this one right here I'm really really like pumped about because it just looks so natural like there are different colors you can always Always, you know change it up you can always different colors you can always customize the colors which is great I just wanted to go with something natural just to start off with because this is like a custom braid wig and have never had a custom braid wig granted I've had like you know the beauty supply brand ones but this one I really really do like it a lot just because of the way it lays and it's made you know it has the adjustable strap it also has the elastic band in it if there aren't any combs in the unit which is fine because you guys know I'm trying to like grow my edges out but if you want combs I'm pretty sure that they will adhere or attach them for you guys you can always request that or you can always put them in yourselves but Listen, honeys, this wig came out gorgeous. Like, I love the hair. It's so full, okay? So, for me, I think I would probably have to bobby pin it down just a little bit, just so that way it doesn't move, because God forbid I'm out in public and my braided wig comes off. Girl, I will have a fat tonies. I give them kudos to this actual product right here for real hair to please uk is definitely a bomb wig website they have a bunch of different ones they have box braids they have corn rolls i mean like listen the styles that they produce are endless and like i said you could always get a custom unit this is cute y'all so I will post all of the information down below for you guys. Let me know what you think of this one right here. And like I said, her name is Laura. They do come in different colors, so you can always choose your own color. Like I said, I went for something natural for the start, but yes, this is very, very pretty. You guys already know, CC friendly, cool and cute. Mm.
So on that note, stay deep and deep delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Check the info box for all of the links and information that you may need. And I'll see you guys in a soon to come video.